three, two, one, go. Welcome back everyone to the life of an outdoorsman. It's a beautiful fall morning here at my friend's pond. I'm coming to you with new style of fishing. This is a style that I have never used for bass before called drop shotting. It is a very effective method. I just have never used it for bass. I've used it for other species. And uh, yeah, we're going to see the little tag end there. We're going to see how many fish we can catch in like, I don't know, what, what should the time be? Hmm. Let's do like 15 minutes. All right. You see it on there on the, on the phone, but it's 15 minutes. I'm going to set the timer and I'm going to see how many fish I can catch with the drop shot in 15 minutes. Let's get started. Three, two, one, go. That was a really bad cast for the first cast, but we'll give it a try. Is it still sinking? Or is it just kind of... There you go. It's hitting all the weeds at the bottom. My line's on a a weed as well. I wonder if it just didn't hit the bottom yet. But, but the bottom consistency here is, is really weedy. So it's, uh, my weight's kind of getting stuck in the weeds, but that's fine. That's fine. Nothing on the first cast. Kind of surprising, but I did hit some weeds a little bit there. So to give it like little shakes kind of. And yeah, you pop it and little shakes and you pop it. Little shakes and you pop it. This pond usually does pretty good. Like it's pretty easy usually to get some something out of here, but something just splashed behind me. This is not looking good. Wasting time. I never even really looked to see how this looks in the water. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's doing too bad. So I can get closer to those weeds over on the far side. That's better. Might get something now. There we go. Fish on. That was a pretty good thud. Yes, there we go. Fish number one. Not a bad size one. Show it off to the camera. Yeah. Good one for the first fish. All right, let's catch another one. Oh, it's all tangled. Let's fix the tangle first and then, how did that happen? What? came loose. It's really weird. There's no knot. How did it untie? Super weird. Okay. I gotta tie this up again. It's wasting 15 minutes. Sorry for if you're seeing blood on my fingers. It is a, a cut that I got last night. I have been trying to get it to stop bleeding and it has not been working. Uh, I totally went the wrong way here. Oh, come on. Something's really wrong here. Totally did this wrong. Wow. What did I do wrong here? This is a bad thing to be messing with in the first few minutes of the of the race here. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, come on. Corporate. Now we're getting somewhere. Okay. Wet it down. Cinch it down. You're supposed to put the eye through here too, but we're just going to go with it as it is. Back in business. We've got one fish in... Oh, wow. We've gone through six minutes already. Yikes. That tangle really messed me up. So let's uh, try and make up for some of that time. 15 minutes is not much when you're trying to uh, beat something. Don't know what I'm trying to beat right now, but I'm trying to beat something, the time, the clock. That last one, I was just sitting in one spot, just shaking it. And then tap, that's all I felt, just a little tap. And you shake it, 
then you pop it to a new spot. Then you shake it, and you pop it to a new spot. Okay, I'm gonna go cast straight down this shoreline this direction. See if we can get further out over there. Exciting, exciting. Turn the camera a bit. Gotta love the colors in the trees back there, eh? Just shake it, shake it, shake it. One spot here, then you pop it to the next spot. Let it sink to the bottom, shake it, shake it. Pop it to the next spot, shake it. This is probably not the best spot on the pond to be doing this challenge, but uh, why not? Give it a try. If I fail, then, uh, which I haven't failed because I already got one, but if I didn't, didn't do that well, then I can just go around to the other side. Try the video again. <laughs> got some weeds on the weight, but that's not a big deal because the weed, the weight's down in the weeds anyways. So if I was not on the time clock here, I'd probably consider taking them off, but I'm kind of running against the clock. So just shake it in place. That's where I had the bite last time was right in this area. So I'm gonna shake it, pop it up. Not getting anything here, running out of time. Don't know how many more casts I'll get in. But let's try back there. Might do well. This is not going well. Nice erratic. Erratic. That's what you need. Erratic. Was oh, it really stuck in something? There's not many rocks down here, but I seem to found one. This challenge may be over. Oh, something gave. Yep. Three minutes left. I'm gonna go run around the shore and see if I can get this out. There we go. It was just stuck down there somehow. Okay, we got like three minutes left. I'm gonna cast out to the middle. Let's turn the camera here. There we go. Out towards the middle. Sometimes they'll take it before it even hits the bottom. Oh, there's a little one. Come on. Hope we didn't like take the tail off of it or something. Nope, another little one. Come on. Nope. Need another one. I have like three minutes left. Come on. I don't even know if I have enough time to cast again. Come on, seriously? Yeah, they did. They took the tail off. Ah. Do I have to have time to change it? One minute, 38 seconds. Speed change of... Speed change of my plastic. I gotta catch one more fish before the time's up. The little things took the tail off. Back in business. Let's go, let's go, let's go. It's gonna sink to the bottom. Only got probably like a minute left. Come on, come on. I can do this. I know I can. I need to not set the hook as quick, I think. Just let him eat it a little bit longer. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm about out of time. There we go. Didn't even turn the camera up. There we go. Well, there's the end of the 10 minutes. I got one fish. I didn't do too bad. That's that's the first time trying to use a drop shot for bass. And in 15 minutes, I get one fish, snagged once, tangled once, had to change my lure out once. That's not bad. So, well, I hope you enjoyed that. And I hope you enjoyed this video. See you next time on the life of an outdoorsman. Thanks for watching. You thought that was it, didn't you? Well, it's not. I'm just gonna keep fishing. Cause like, why not? Like, it's a beautiful day, beautiful morning. And I only caught one fish. So why not, why not, why not fish some more? So yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm fishing some more.
think what I'm going to do now, because I'm not constrained to time, is I'm going to do one round around the pond. Because I don't have a whole lot of time here to spend, but I have a little bit. So I'm going to take, uh, take my time and go around the pond, fish all the good spots, and then uh, see how many we can get. Is that the whole point of fishing, right? Let's see how many fish you can get. Or a big one. I would take less, but a bigger one. But like, I'd take numbers too. It's just, that, that's the way it goes. Just look at that beautiful view. Nice dark clouds. Tails all poofing out. It's just beautiful. So I had just realized that that whole last segment I had was on slow motion. This being said, let's just, you know, oh, there's some little ones going after it. I feel it already. Maybe I'll have a better shot at it over here. We'll see. There we go. That's one. Come in here. Oh, he's in the weeds. He's in the dang weeds. Come on. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. He's getting caught. The weight's getting caught. Check out that one. Another nice bass for the camera. Take this hook out, right in the top of the mouth, way down in there. Like, oh, bottom of the mouth, sorry. Not too far down in there. Pops out. Nice fish. Let's get him back. here uh, I'll fix my, fix my lure I try and get one more fish before I have to leave here so before I finish up the video Let's see if we can get a another nice little bass for the video Okay, well, that'll be it. I did catch two fish, not too bad. A little morning session. Hope you enjoyed watching the life of an outdoorsman and me catching fish and not catching fish and then catching fish again. I hope you enjoyed the little challenge at the beginning of this video, the 15 minutes. Um, I did succeed which is <laughs> pretty good. I thought I would have had probably two fish maybe, but maybe if I didn't have the tangles and everything, I would have got something. But in any case, I'm rambling. Thanks for watching, Life of an Outdoorsman. We'll see you next time. And yes, this is the end of the video now. That's it.